Good evening, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Oh. Good evening, teacher. Are I you? am here, present. Great, excellent, excellent. We will start in a moment. All right, all right. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. ¿Qué tal el fin de semana? How was your weekend? I fight. Fine. Great. Bye. Awesome. Awesome. And you? Very good, actually. Super good. Right. So, a lot of activities. So we will see here who else is here. Mr. Iglesias, David, Herbert, Benjamin, Magdalena, Santos, and Wilder. Okay, cool. So let's start. Mm. All right, so let's see. Just one second, please. I was just waiting for my second device to um, share the screen so you can see the class, okay? Okay, there it is. It's loading. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Magdalena. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. So let's see. I am love for working on the weekend. Oh, really? Yeah, sure. No day off? No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, working, working, working. Uh, I see here. Oh my goodness, I don't know why you, I always have this problem with this device right here, excuse me. Don't worry, teacher. Thank you. All right, perfect. So it's supposed to be there finally, right? So let's see, let's see, let's see. Excellent. All right, everybody, we are going to start right now practicing. So you can see it right now. And it is going to be with one of the activities that we normally do every single day. So which is going to be a tone twister. This is just a short turn twister, but you have to pay attention to the pronunciation of every word. All right, so... Let me just like try to uh help you with this one right here. It says Peter Piper. Repeat it. Peter Piper. Peter Piper. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Peter Piper. Yes, that's right. All right. So and it says right here with this. Peter one. Piper. Peter Piper. I'll try to um write the pronunciation of every word right here, which is gonna be like this one. P. Peter, like this one, Peter, well, what happens here? Piper, repeat it, buddy, Peter Piper. Peter Piper. Peter Piper, all right, so, picked. Pick. A peck of pico peppers. Pick a peck, repeat. Sure, no problem. It says, 
Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle peppers. One more time. Let me share right here. One sec. Okay. Sorry about that. So take a look at this one. It says, Peter, let's see if I can write it right here. It's going to be this one. Peter. Piper. Peter Piper. Piper. Right. Piper. Pick. Ah. Pick. A pick. Like this one here of pickles. Pickles. Pickles, sorry. Pickles. Pickles. Peppers. Pickles. And then you go with this one. A pick of pickle. Pickle peppers, Peter, Piper, picked. Hey, Per. Ahí está. Entonces, we have to read the red letters. Vamos leyendo lo que está en rojo, tal cual está, like the way it is there, all right? And it says, Peter Piper picked a peco pico peppers, a peco pico peppers, Peter Piper picked. Vamos más despacio. All right, so it will be Piper, Piper picked Piper a pick peck a of peck of old peppers. Pickle peppers. A peck of pickle pe peppers. Peter Piper picked. Picked. All right, so let's try. So right now I am going to give you two minutes. All right, so you can practice, practice, and practice this tone twister until you can actually manage this correctly. All right, so you can pronounce Piper. it. Practice, 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 practice. Pick a peck of pickle paper, a peck of pickle. Yes, Magdalena, tell me. Picks. Peppers. Pick. Pick. Piper. Pick. Okay. Practice, practice, practice. Peter, Piper, pick a peck of pickle. Peter, Piper. Pick a peck of pickled peppers, a peck of pickled pepper, Peter Piper, pick. Peter Piper, yes. Very good, very good. Continue practicing. Peter Piper, pick a peck of pickled peppers, a peck of pickled mm -hmm. peppers, Peter Piper, pick. No hay una forma de cómo poder apagar solo estas luces de acá y dejar allá. I don't know. Solo las de aquí enfrente. Yes. Sí. Ah, perfecto, excelente. Cool. Ahí con el audio. Apaga el audio. That's fine. We muted. We muted him. All right. So, well, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Excellent, 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 excellent. Mr. Saul Ernesto, listening in your class for work reason. No problem. All right. Excellent. Thank you. You still have one more minute. One more minute. Remember, Peter Piper picked a peco pico peppers. A peco pico peppers, Peter Piper picked. All right. So, Peter Piper picked a peco pico peppers. <laughs> a peco pico peppers, Peter Piper picked. All right. So, just practice, 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 practice. So, you can be volunteers later. Peter All right. Piper pick a peck. Very good. Very good. Excellent. Excellent. Pico mm. Piper, a peco pico. Pepper, Piper, 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 Pick. Peter, Piper, Pick, a pick, a ball, all pickled peppers, a peel, all pickled peppers, Piper, Piper, Pips. Very good. Piper. Excellent. So, Peter, Piper, Pick, a peck of pickled peppers, a peck of pickled peppers, Peter, Piper, Pick. All right. Excellent. Time's up. All right. So, it's time for me to listen to some volunteers repeating this tone twister. So who is going to be my volunteer number one? Volunteer me, number one? Me, me teacher. teacher. Thank you very much. So veamos, who was it? Uh, Wilbur, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Piper. 
peer paper pick a pack of pickle paper a pack of pickle paper pick peer paper pick very good excellent thank you thank you thank you i like it right so that was actually nice as well all right thank you magdalena you go with the next one yes Peter Piper pick a pack of pickled paper, a pack of pickled pe peppers, paper, paper, pits. Excellent. Good job, Magdalena. That was actually well done. All right. Mr. Iglesias, please go ahead. Okay. Piper, Piper pick a pack of pickled paper, a pack of pickled paper, Piper, Piper pick. Peter Piper picked. All right, very good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, good job, good job. Super good. All right, next one, it will be Mr. Carlos Cruz. Hello, sir. Peter Piper pick a pick of pickle paper, a pick of pickle paper, Peter Piper pick. Thank you, good job, good job. All right, so thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so next, next, next. Who's going to be the next one? Me, teacher. Hey, Mundo, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Go ahead, please. Uh, Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled pepper, a peck of pickled pepper, Peter Piper picked. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. All right. Am I missing anybody else? Any other volunteer? Yeah, yeah, teacher. Okay, it was uh, Benjamin and Enrique, if I'm not wrong, right? Okay, let's start with Enrique. Okay. Um, Peter, paper, pep, a uh, pep, up, uh, pickle, paper, a uh, pep, up, pickle, paper, Peter, paper, pick. Excellent. Thank you, right? Peter Piper picked. All right, Peter Piper picked. Excellent. Thank you. Uh -huh. Who was another one? Benjamin, right? Okay, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Peter, okay. Peter paper, pick a pet of pickled paper, a pet of pickled paper, Peter paper, a pick. Thank you, my friend. Super good job, all right? So you were doing good as well. Thank you. Who's next? Who's next? Mr. Herbert Oja, what happens? Volunteer. Voy a intentarlo, teacher. Let's do it. Peter Piper picked a pick of pickled papers. Ya lo tiene Marcelo. Papers a pick of pickled papers. Peter Piper picked. Thank you. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right. So good job, everybody else. You were participating. Remember the purpose of this one is that you're trying. E intentarlo, ¿verdad? Y a la vez practicar y aprender. Of course, to learn how to pronounce these things. All right. <clears throat> Let's continue with the next activity for today. All right. So this is just a review. A review of, about what we were just studying last um, we'll class, be. right? Let's so I, if you remember to. the last class, we were talking about a uh, wheel and going to, of course, right? So uh, remember something that I want you to remember, which is important. It's this part right here. All right. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Can someone help me to read this part? This volunteer for reading? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Volunteer for reading? This part? Yes. Hello, hello. Me, teacher. Thank you, Mundo. Please help me to read that um, circle section. Will versus going to. Mm -hmm. Will express. Future uh, action design. This, uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, this section here. Oh, the okay. Mm -hmm. Will versus going to. Both will and going to can be used to for making future prediction without having a real difference in meaning. Thank you very much. Yeah. All right. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The grammar rules says also that uh, you know a, a pesar like even though they have differences, right? So. Uh, they can be used uh, for making future predictions without any difference in meaning, right? So saying that que, as, uh, siempre cuando, as long as you want to speak about future, you can use will or you can use going to. 
remember the difference, right? So for example, if you want to say, uh, in this case right here, if you want to say, um, yo iré a la fiesta, All right, so this in, in, in future, ¿cómo sería? ¿Con will or con going to? Yo iré a la fiesta. I, I will. I oh, will. I, I'll, I'll go to the party. I will go to the party. I will go to a party. There you go. Exactly, all right? So thank you, thank you, thank you. So this one in here is going to be, we have a different color. Oops, okay. everything goes red. All right, so yo iré a la fiesta, I will go to the party. But if I want to say, for example, in this case right here, eh... You know, yo voy a ir a la fiesta, which is going to be here. There you go. How do you say this in English? I am going to. I'm going to. Uh, go. Go. I'm going, going to go. I'm going to go. Party. To party. All right. So, it happens right here when you go and say, for example, this one. I right? So, it does this. Based on this one, what you need to remember is this one. Every time you have, for example, iré, iré, comeré, estaré, veré, all right? So, that's going to be will, right? Will. And then, when you say it like, voy a, this is going to be going to, all right? Will. So, like that one. And then, depending on the subject, right? So, for example, we have another subject right here. I'm talking about like... It says right here. He. Perdón. Él jugará. Fútbol. How do you say this in English? Iglesia, el audio, Iglesia. No tengo ningún audio yo. Interferencia. Eh, a ver, ¿quién es el que tiene el audio abierto de otro lado? Oh, ya debe ser. <laughs> no, I guess it was Enrique. Sorry. Yes. All right. Okay, fine. Uh, and then, how do you say this one in English? Él jugará fútbol. He will play football. Soccer. No, He soccer. He will play soccer. Play Very soccer. good. Excellent. Thank you. All right, so, and then we go on this one right here. How do you say them, for example, if you want to say this one again? If you want to say, for example, right here, ¿Qué pasa cuando queremos usar now él, pero we're going to? All right, so, él va a jugar fútbol. So, how do you say this in English? He is going to play soccer. He is going, is, to, he is play going to play soccer. Play soccer. soccer. So that's actually the difference that I want you to understand right here. All right. So jugará, it will be in English, will play. All right. So va a jugar. All right. So in this case will be, is going to play. Aquí era, I am going to play. ¿Por qué? Porque el sujeto era I. Aquí el sujeto es he. That's the reason why. So this is just the review about what we were studying last Friday. All right. So do you have any questions so far? No questions or questions? Mm -hmm. No question, teacher. No questions. All right. Very good. Excellent. So let me just eliminate this and I can continue here with a short exercise. No question. Wow, good. Excellent. Vamos a ver si, like, let's see if this is completely clear with the following exercise, right? In this case, we are going to choose will or going to. All right. So to determine this one. All right, so, eh, lo que vamos a ver, it could be any of them, puede ser cualquiera de los dos, pero vamos a ver cuál se pega más. Dijimos que will es como para predicciones, cosas que, like, not completamente cierto. All right, so, y el eh, going to es algo un poco más seguro that is going to happen, que va a pasar. All right, so let's see, for example, in the number one, it says Tom will or is going to be 18 years old next year. ¿Cuál sería ahí, my friends? It's going to be. It's going to be, porque eso going es un hecho. Be, exactly. uh, un hecho. Exactly. Es como it's a fact. Que él tiene 18 años. Exactly. So it, it's yeah. impossible that he's going to be 17 again or 20, right? So it has, it has to be 
18, 18, right? 18, 18. Yes, exactly, right? Then, super important in number two, it says, I think. I think Sara mm -hmm, to love this will. song. What is going will. to happen with this one? Will. I think Sara will love Sarah this song. Sara will. Exactly. It will be will love here because you're saying love. I think. So I am not sure, right? So then in number three, it says right here, my sister will or is going to study in Warsaw. Right, so what is it's going to? My sister is it's going, going to, to it's going, going to going to start uh, yeah, no, it's about studying. So my sister will I guess it's not going to mm -hmm. oh. share my sister was on the web starting in Warsaw. Aparece audio cedillo. No, yo estoy participando. <laughs> oh my god. Se está partiendo los huevos, es que tienen que apagarle el audio. <laughs> oh my god. I don't listen. Calmado, calmado, no te enojes. Okay, um, so well, number 4, number 4, right? So <laughs> with number 4, it says, look at the sky. It will or it's oh, going to rain. God. It's going to rain. It's going to rain. Okay. Look. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. It's going to. It's going to rain. All right. Excellent. It's so. Going to rain. Um, it's it says number five. I've got a headache. And then you go like. I will. Or I'm going to get you a painkiller. What is a painkiller, my friends? This word, painkiller. Head. Pastilla para el dolor. Una pastilla para el dolor o el um, analgésico. Analgésico. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Very good. So, and what is headache? Will. Dolor de cabeza. Dolor de cabeza. Very picture. good. So, I have got the headache. So, that he had. Headache. Three headache. will or going to? Will. Hmm? Mm. I will. No, I'm going to. Yes, porque si... No, I'm going to. Oh, okay. Dolor de cabeza, papá. All right. So I'm like going way. to. All right. Excellent. So uh, then you go with number six. I will or I am going to make a pizza. Have we got any cheese in the fridge? I will. I will. Very, Very good. Well, will. Porque aquí depende de los ingredients, right? Sí. Si... Si no está el cheese, no hace la pizza. Of course, right? Depends on that one. Thank you. What about number seven? I will or I'm going to send you an SMS in the evening. I promise. Mm -hmm. I, I promise. promise. I, I promise. Yes. So what is it? Mm, I'm going. Yes. By saying I it's promise, okay. ya me estoy como comprometiendo, right? So, mm -hmm. porque si no te lo prometo. So, it's going to be like this one. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. What number eight? I spoke to Helen yesterday. So, she will or she is going to buy a new car? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you think? She will. She will. She will. She will. Very good. Well, in this case, right there. All right. So, and it goes like this one. It will be she will because it doesn't say when, right? So, so it's just saying in the future, anytime, right? So, mm -hmm. number nine says, "Don't worry. I'm sure everything will be or is going to be okay." What it's about number nine? Be. I'm sorry. It's going, it's going to be okay. Mm -hmm. I am sure. Are you sure? No, don't worry. <laughs> I am sure. <laughs> All right, excellent. So it's going to be okay. Very good. 
And then number 10, hey, what are your plans for the weekend? I will or I'm going to go to the cinema. I have won a ticket plans, for the latest plans. James Bond movie. What is it? I'm going. Going to, porque ya tengo los tickets, of course, right? Yeah. Excellent. Okay, excellent. So in this one, just to clarify, so hemos seleccionado, we have selected uh, a specific answer, right? Para aplicar las reglas, to apply the rules, but you know that it can be any of the two options, right? So for example, um, if I'm going to say, for example, this one uh, in number two, dijimos que era wheel, of course, that's correct. That's a correct answer. Right. Pero si yo digo, I think Sarah is going to love this song. Actually, it, it not, doesn't change the idea too much in future. All right. So just for you to keep it in mind, of course. Right. So questions about this activity, my friends? No questions. Teacher. No questions. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Thank for me. It's okay. The rest? Questions? Can I continue? El resto. <laughs> what? Continue, and, teacher. All right, so I, I guess you say continue. All right, so very good. So, so, so right now, idea. my friends, we are you are going to help me to complete the conversation with the appropriate forms of be going to or will. All right, so for example, it says right here, have you made any vacation plans? Well, I have decided one thing. I, in this space right here, what are you going to write? Going to or will? I will. Okay. Let's take a look. I will go camping. I will. It says right here. I will go camping. All right. So that's great. All right. So. ¿Por qué dejamos will? Well, actually, it's a plan. All right. So then, that's great. For how long? I? I'm going. I'm going, going to be to away for a week. I'm going to be away for a week. Going for a week. I'm going to. Very uh, good. Exactly. I'm going to. Yeah, we can actually leave it like that. I'm going to be away for a week. Excellent. Thank you. I only have five days of vacation. All right. So when are you leaving? That's the question right there. So when are you leaving? I'm not sure. So I... uh -huh. I says, I'm not sure. Year, so what is it? I'm not sure. I will. I will, of course. I around the end of I may will probably live around the end of may but very good excellent thank you so what's next here all right and and where are you going to go where all right where, where? are you uh, going to going to go uh, going to are you going to there you go are you going to go exactly right i haven't thought about that yet i guess i guess it's like i, will, I think i will go exactly will. very good i will Go to one of the national parks. That sounds like fun. Yeah, maybe I will. I will. I will. It says right here. I will. I will go um, hiking and do some fishing. And then it says like a question. Hiking to some fish. Are you? Are, are you? you? Okay, very good. Are you? Are you going to, to rent? Are going to. you going to? Are you going to? 
going to rent. Very good. Are you rent. going to rent a camper? All right. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Actually, I probably rent a camper. It's too expensive. All right. Are you going to go? Are you going one? to go? Mm -hmm. Are you going to? Are you going to go with anyone? No, I need some time alone. I. Uh -huh. I'm going to travel. I am going by myself. To travel. So no, travel, is... travel, no teacher. Oh, yes, it's here. It's over there. Thank you. So we got this answer right here. Very good. I am going to travel by myself. Okay, excellent. So thank you, everybody, for helping me completing the conversation, right? So now uh, I need some volunteers that are going to help me to rate the conversation, right? So like two people at the same time who are going to be my first two volunteers. Mm -hmm. Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, Edmundo. So you need one more. Uh, me, teacher. Uh, that was who? Wilbur, okay. Edmundo and Wilbur, who is going to start? I'm going to be uh, A. A, okay, very good, excellent. So, Edmundo A, Wilbur B. Okay, continue. Hey. Have you made any vacation plans? You made... Well, I I live this on, on the one thing. Decide. I will uh, go camping. That's great. For how long? I am going to be... Uh, Okay, for a week, I only have five days of vacation. So, when are you leaving? I'm, I'm not sure. I will probably leave half or a room the is of May. And where are you going to go? I haven't. So about that, yet it's guess I will go to one of the national park. That's only fun. Yeah, maybe I will go. He, um, what is the is a palabra hiking. teacher? Hiking, 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 and do some some fishing. Are you going to run the camper? I am not sure. Actually, I am probably probably rent a camper is uh, too expensive. Expensive. Are you going to with uh, anyone? No, I need uh, some time alone. I going to uh, travel by myself. Okay. All right, very good. Excellent, excellent job, my friends. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. All right, remember, Wilbur, hiking. Repeat it. Hiking. There you go. Excellent. Thank you, thank you, thank you, right? What is a hiking, teacher? It's um, como caminatas, you know? Like senderismo. A, oh, se llama, how do you say this one? Senderismo. S senderismo. Mm -hmm. Senderismo, senderismo, which is like, you know, caminatas entre la naturaleza. Uh, you know, those natural places, of course, right? So thank you, my friends. All right, I need another um, volunteer. Well, other two volunteers, all right? So who are going to be my next two volunteers? Let's see. Yeah, here. Yeah. Volunteers, tengo a uh, Mr. Adam and Magdalena, okay? Adam, you can be letter A and Magdalena, letter B, okay? Have you made any vacation plans? A. Adam, <laughs> microphone. Yeah. A or B? You, Adam, A. Magdalena, B. Oh, okay. okay. Have you made any vacation plans? Will I be decide 
on one time. I will go camping. That's great for your how long. I am going to always for a weekend. I only have five days of vacation. So where are, are you living? I'm not sure. I will probably, uh, probably live around the end of May. And where are you going to go? I have a thought about a uh, jet. I was I will go to one of the national parks. The sun life farm. There may be. I will go hiking and some and do some fin fishing. Fishing. Mm -hmm. Are you going to run a camper? Camper is okay. Camper. Okay. Yes, camper. 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 I know. Sure. Yes. Actually, I, I probably rent a camper. It's too expensive. Are you going to go with anyone? No. I need some time alone. I am going to travel by myself. Okay. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Magdalena and Mr. Iglesias. Good job, good job. All right. So remember, Mr. Iglesias, camper. Camper. Correct. Camper. Very good. Excellent. Okay. All right. So good. So uh, una recommendation, una recomendación para like everybody, para todos cuando you are reading, right? Tratemos de decir las R como en inglés, like R, camper. right? Así, for example, eh, cuando un americano tries to speak Spanish, ellos siempre usan su eres, like the English, right? Por eso dicen querer, comer, right? Because su eres suena así. Entonces, tratemos de pronunciar esa R de esa manera. No como R, sino que como R. Por ejemplo, camper. Para que no suene como camper, sino que suene como camper. 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 There we go. Excellent. Thank you. All right. Let's see. Okay. And uh, let's just continue then with the next activity which is going to be, let me clean here the screen. There you go, excellent, thank you. Okay, excellent, so well, let's see what's the next activity about, all right? So can someone help me to read the instruction here? The instruction, instruction? Just reading, please, one person for, excuse me, for reading. Huh? Me teacher, thank I you very you... much. Uh -huh. I have you don't about your next vacation. Rice, um, rice. What is it, teacher? Answer. Answer. Mm -hmm. Answer to this Answer. question. Questions. Mm -hmm. Question. If you're early, if you early have already, 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 already have plans. You uh, be be going to if you don't have what do you say fees fisek fix fisek fix fix plan fix. you see will use use will use use will use all right will. very good excellent thank you very much now what are we going to do here it's going to be very simple okay so we are going to answer the questions right here and let's see let's see let's see all right so let's just do this one but once everyone has like you know unas cadenas aquí como like de pregunta yo le voy a la pregunta a alguien i am going to ask the question to someone y esa persona la va a hacer la misma pregunta to another person and so on hasta que completemos por lo menos cinco personas con la misma pregunta okay so, for example, for example, uh, Wilbur, how are you going to spend your next vacation? Are you going to anywhere? Que vas a hacer tu siguiente vacation, right? Entonces viene y me dice, uh, what's your answer, Wilbur? ¿Cuál sería tu respuesta? I will, um, Ruining my family. Um, I will get, excuse me, I will what? I will uh, ruining my family. Correr mi familia. I will, ah, uh, 
I will run. run. Sería, forma base. I will run. run. With will run. My family. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Ajá. ¿Qué más? Unos dos planes um, más. Um, este, visitar algún centro turístico. Ok. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice? ¿Cómo se dice visitar, my friend? Visit. Visit. I will visit a touristic place. Touristic place. Oops. Ok. Ahora viene Wilbur y hace la misma question number one. Vamos a la tarde. La mujer se me llegó tarde. Me dieron 12. Que llegó tarde, dice. Ok, cool. All right, so. And then, eh, ahora Wilbur le, is going to ask the question to another person. The same question to another person, Wilbur. Uh, how are you going to spend? Your next vacation, I I will a quién le preguntaron? Who did Wilbur Nadie. ask? No dijo. Wilbur. No, ahí mi, mi, mi okay. Um bueno, el señor este David Antonio está voluntario ahí. Okay, so ask the question. Uh, the question number, number one. one or number two? Number one, number one. Okay. Who are you going to spend your next vacation? Are you going to Antigua? Anywhere. 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 My Miss uh, Sir Davy. Okay, okay. I will shopping. I will go shopping. Shopping. ¿Cómo se dice con mi esposa, teacher? I will go. With my wife. My wife, with my wife. Okay, what else? Tell me another one. Another activity, Mr. Eh, Rosales. Lo understand, teacher. Otra actividad, another um, activity. Yeah. Aparte de go shopping, ¿qué más? What else besides go shopping? I will uh, cooking. I will cook. Cocinar. Ajá, uh -huh. solo cook. I ah, okay. will... I will cook. Cook. Like that one. That's it, that's it. Very good. Excellent. Thank you, thank you. All right, now you, David, choose another person. Select another person. Elija a otra persona, David. Choose another person, please. Uh -huh. Hello, David. How are you going to spend your next vacation? Are you going to anywhere, um, Mr. Gallegos? Hey, thank you. Mr. Gallegos, I'm going. I am going to the beach. Okay. With my family. All right. I I will. I will to see a Messi. Oh my God! Nice. I will see Messi. I will see Messi. Very good. Interesting. I will see right. Messi. Oh. Very good. <laughs> There you go. Excellent. Thank you. Let's go with the question number two. Uh, who's going to be my first volunteer for question number two? That's expensive. Oh, yes. Uh -huh. Volunteer for question number two? Yes, yes, yes. No volunteers. Oh, my goodness. Yes, Thank you, Edmundo. I'm going to ask you the question number two then. All right. When are you going... Uh, to take your vacation. I'm going to. I'm not sure. Maybe I I I will be rest on my hammock. Mm -hmm. No, but like yeah? the question number two says when. When. when? Um, 
Uh, I'm going to take my vacation uh, from uh, 22, um, maybe uh, three, the next month. <laughs> okay, excellent. So in that case, you say uh, from Samba. December 22nd, 22nd to yeah. December 24th, you said? No, uh, it's uh, January 1st. Oh, to January 1st. January? First? First. Or three? Yeah. Primero or tercero? Tercero. Third. Third. Mm -hmm. So, the, entonces, I am going to take my vacation from December 22nd to January 3rd. Repeat it, please. I'm going to take my vacation from, from uh, December 22nd to uh, 3rd of January. 3rd of January. All right. Excellent. Thank you. Now, you, Edmundo, choose the next person and ask exactly the same question number two. All right. <laughs> Maria Magdalena. <laughs> uh -huh. Did you copy Maria Magdalena? Did you hear? Magdalena is having dinner. Having dinner, okay. Another 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 person. Yeah. Uh... Santos, Santo Mauricio, nobody, Mister Lucha, hoy, te voy a contestar yo, Mister Lemos, Mister Lemos, voy a intentar. How are you going to spend your next vacation? The 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 first sentence, uh, the the first question. Uh, the second, the second one, Mr. Martinez. The, the second one. Mm -hmm. uh, when are you going to take your vacation, Mr. Ramos? For me, uh, I will uh, to visit family uh, 26 December. From, from December 26? Uh, 26. Yes, 26. Visit uh, my parents, Greek family, okay. uh, St. Peter, uh, City, Aguachapan. St. Peter? Yeah. Okay, interesting. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. um, el, I will uh, 20 to a uh, week family in San Salvador City. To San Salvador City, all right. In San January, we January 2nd? Uh, yes. Okay, very good, excellent, thank you. Thank you everybody for helping me with this activity right here. So questions, no questions? Question, teacher. Question. Okay, very good. Excellent. Ahora sí. Everybody, I want you to pay attention. Pay attention, pay attention. Because we are going to be working with the next activity. And the next activity, it's a listening. Okay? Listening, 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 listening. All right, all right. Ready, my friends, for the listening? Yes. yes, teacher, ready. Okay, pay attention. It teacher. says, listen to Judy, Paul, and Brenda describe their summer plans. Check the correct piece of information about each person's plan, right? For example, it says who is going to learn about a different culture. De, de acuerdo a lo que ustedes escuchen, van a decir quién de los tres es el que va a aprender acerca de una cultura diferente. To learn about a different culture. Yuri, Paul, or Brenda. Ahí de acuerdo a lo que ustedes escuchen. All right. Eh, number two. Who will probably visit several different countries? ¿Quién de ustedes va? Several significa what, people? Varios. Varios. Very good. So several different countries. Right. Very good. Eh, probably won't take a vacation. One of those three people, it's not going to take vacations, right? Who? I don't know. 
Number four, it says it's going to um, lie on the beach. What is lie, my friends? Lie on the beach? Descansar. Descansar, yeah. acostarse o recostarse. Acostarse. Right? So, very good. And the last one, uh, who is going to do something exciting and a little dangerous? So you are going to listen to that information and then you guys are going to um, check that one. All right. Your microphone, teacher. Yeah, sorry. Mr. Um, Martinez, El Mundo, can you take the screenshot of this activity and send it to the WhatsApp group, please? Yes, no problem, teacher. Thank you very much. I'm going to stop sharing this so I can share the, the audio, okay? So let's see. Okay, let me stop sharing okay. this one. Thank you. I'm going to stop the share right here. It's loading. One second. One, listening, summer plans, part A. Listen to Judy, Paul, and Brenda describe their summer plans. What is each person going to do? One, Judy. So what are you planning to do on your vacation, Judy? Oh, I'm going to do something different this year. I went to Hawaii last year and just relaxed on the beach for two weeks. This year, I'm going whitewater rafting. Oh, that sounds fun. But what is that exactly? Oh, well, they have these trips down the rapids. The water gets really rough, but I think it'll be really exciting. Oh, I'm doing some mountain climbing, too. And you call that a vacation? Two, Paul. What are your plans for this summer, Paul? Oh, I'd love to go and lie on a beach somewhere, but I need to save some money for school. I think I'll stay home and get a job. That doesn't sound like much fun. Oh, it won't be so bad. Some of my friends are going to work this summer too, so we'll have a good time on the weekends. 3. Brenda Have you planned anything for the summer, Brenda? Yeah. I'm going to work the first month and save some money. Then I'm going to Mexico to visit my sister. She's working in Guadalajara. She says it's really interesting there, so I want to see what it's like. I'm really looking forward to it. Okay, very good. Uh, I am going to repeat it one more time. I'm going to repeat it one more time, okay? Units five to six progress check. Page 42, exercise one, listening. Summer plans, part A. Listen to Judy, Paul, and Brenda describe their summer plans. What is each person going to do? One, Judy. So what are you planning to do on your vacation, Judy? Oh, I'm going to do something different this year. I went to Hawaii last year and just relaxed on the beach for two weeks. This year, I'm going whitewater rafting. Oh, that sounds fun. But what is that exactly? Oh, well, they have these trips down the rapids. The water gets really rough, but I think it'll be really exciting. Oh, I'm doing some mountain climbing, too. And you call that a vacation? Two, Paul. What are your plans for this summer, Paul? Oh, I'd love to go and lie on a beach somewhere, but I need to save some money for school. I think I'll stay home and get a job. That doesn't sound like much fun. Oh, it won't be so bad. Some of my friends are going to work this summer too, so we'll have a good time on the weekends. 3. Brenda 
Have you planned anything for the summer, Brenda? Yeah. I'm going to work the first month and save some money. Then I'm going to Mexico to visit my sister. She's working in Guadalajara. She says it's really interesting there, so I want to see what it's like. I'm really looking forward to it. Okay, very good. So now let's just continue here and let's go back to the presentation. Excellent. So now let's see. Number one, who is going to learn about a different culture? Judy, Paul, or Brenda? Brenda. So you said it's Brenda, right? Yes, Brenda. Brenda. Yes, Brenda. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Number two. Who will probably visit several different countries? Brenda. Brenda. No. Uh, yes. Uh, Mexico, Guadalajara. Yeah. Okay. Who probably won't take a vacation? Paul. Paul. Why? Paul. He's going to get a, a, a job. Yeah. A job. You know, exactly. Because, yeah, a summer job. Yeah. Very good. A summer job. Yes. Thank you. Who is going to lie on the beach? Judy. 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 Okay. And who is going to do something exciting and a little Judy. bit dangerous? Judy. 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 Very good. Excellent. Judy. Thank you, everybody. Congratulations. That was actually a good job with the listening. Good, 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 good. Excellent. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So, well, now, no. my friends, let's no. go here with the next activity. And this is the last activity for tonight. Well, and remember, this question, it's a question that I asked you a couple of classes ago, right? And you gave me ideas only about like comer, salir, bailar, etc., etc., right? So, but now you are going to give me the same ideas you told me before, but now using will or going to, right? Because we're talking about plans for Christmas. So for example, who can share some ideas about the activities that you guys are going to be doing if, on the next Christmas, for example? Mm -hmm. What are the activities that you are going to be doing the next Christmas? Mm -hmm. You see in future, of course. I I I I will dance all the that I will dance all the that all the night long. All night long. All night, night long. long. Very good. Excellent. So Edmundo says I will dance all the night long. Voy a bailar toda la noche, it says. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. All right. What about it's, the rest? It's true, Locha. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Family teacher. Maybe I, I, I will dream. A lot too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maria, I'm sorry, Magdalena. What did you what did you say? I will go cook with my family. I will go cook. Man. Oh cocinar, cocinar. Cook. El go, entonces. Cook. So, nada más, I will cook. 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 Uh -huh. I will cook. I will go visit. I will cook with my family. All right, so very good. Esa tal vez podría ser también my family. Teacher. Sorry. My family and I will cook. There you go. Excellent. Looks better. Eh, Yo ajá. pensé, pensé que era sencillo. Pensé que la sencillo iba a sacar los pasos prohibidos igual que lucha. Uh, <laughs> like, for example, Magdalena. Me, teacher. Magdalena. Magdalena. En el mundo will dance. Sí, va. Yes. No, it's share. Magdalena en el mundo will dance. That's example. Okay. Good example. All right. So, uh huh. What's next? Teacher. Yes. Uh, me, teacher. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, I going more, uh, more eat uh, pan rellenos. Okay. One more time. I am going to eat stuffed bread. What is a lucha? Gandul. Stuffed. 
No, estufa es bra. Estufa es bra. Ahí está. I am going to eat stuffed bread. Repeat it. I'm going to eat a stuffed bread. Stuffed bread. All right. El, el, solo para aclarar, el nombre siempre sería pan con pollo, porque es, es un platillo en español. All right. Pero para explicarle, for example, a un nativo que es un pan con pollo, decimos un stuffed bread, que vendría siendo lo que ellos entienden como un pan relleno. All right. So, good. What else? What other activities can you use? Uh -huh. ¿Qué otra actividad? Tenemos ahí Visit the Family. Uh -huh. What else? What else? What else? I want to eat tamales. I to visit family. Okay, so I have here I will eat tamales. What else? I will drink beer all night long. Oh my God, I will drink Beers all night long. Okay, good grammar. All <laughs> right, so good. Uh -huh. What else? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What else? What else can you do on Christmas? The Mr. Uh, uh, Gallegos, huh? mm -hmm. Otro level. <laughs> all right. Vamos, tell me one more, please. One more. Buen apetit. Enjoy it. It's just la buen apetit as well. Very good. Uh -huh. I'm, going, I'm going to visit at the beach. Okay, right. So I am going to go to the beach. Sería. Go, going to go to the beach. Very good. Excellent. I am going to visit my, my father. Ah, okay. I am going to visit my father in Acajutla City. My father. All right. So, very good. I will go to Acajutla, for example. I will, I will go to Acajutla. I will go to Acajutla. Very good. Excellent. So, well, thank you. You see, now you can uh, provide examples using a uh, simple future with or going to to talk about the next activities or the activities for the next Christmas. All right. Questions? No questions. No question. No questions. Okay. okay. If you don't have questions, no me, question. All right. So <laughs> we are going to stop right here. So and I will see you tomorrow. Remember, tomorrow it's our last class. All right. Tomorrow is the ultima okay. class. Así que todos right. Please conectados. Right. So I will see you tomorrow. Okay. Okay, See you tomorrow. Take care, okay, my tomorrow. friends. Have a good night. Bye, bye. Good night. Good night, bye. teacher. Good night, everybody. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye, thank everybody. you.